Why these niggas still tapping in they savings? Why these niggas still writing telling statements? Man, probably could've cooked me a steak. Working here it is. Hi, it's me, your author. You're Jennifer. Or you can call me, you know, your friendly neighbor, Hufflepuff, Jennifer. Yeah, you can call me that. Okay, so, uh, hi, wait, wait. Once we start the video, before that, how are you guys? My subscribers, how are you? Each I'm asking this question to each and every one of you. How are you? Because if you think that you're just a subscriber to my channel, you're not. You guys are my family, my fans, my fam, my friends, my best friends. You know, I appreciate and care each and one of you. So if you want to talk, if you want to talk to me or something, if you want to share something to me, or if you feel alone, just ping, just ring me up. There are links given in the description and the description and the box description box. You know what I mean? Description box of my YouTube channel. You on I have Instagram, Pinterest. Yeah, you can contact me there. I'm I'm f always free for you guys. You don't know how much you mean to me. All right, I love you each and one of you. Now, back to the. Back to the question. Back to the video. Um, okay. Is my accent annoying? Is my voice annoying? You know, I have an Indian accent. I'm Indian. I have. An, I think. I think so that I have an Indian accent. I know I have an annoying voice. You know, sometimes, and I have a speaking problem. You know, so I have a speaking problem. So just manage with me, guys. Yeah. So like two days ago, I posted on my youtube channel that give me some truths or give me some dares and you guys did which i'm very thankful for and now i'm going to answer that so the first is by oblivion truth what do people do that annoys you the most okay this question this truth is like there are so many people so many people and so many things that can annoy me you know but i'll go with when 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 they don't let you finish your sentence your conversation like you were like you were speaking and they just hi do you know that oh my god like that, like they just barge in and they don't give you the satisfaction of finishing your conversation like like it's so embarrassing like it's so disgusting like they don't know how much annoying they are being right now right i think so that's the most annoying thing a person can do yeah that's the most annoying thing that person can do for, for me the, it's my opinion it's not have to be same with everyone number two my camera is being so shitty guys burden me for that number three your single most favorite thing about cedric okay there i just can i just can't just point something about him that i like that i love the whole package you know what i mean definitely you know i just i love the whole package everything he has from the tip of his hair to his other tip to his toe tip everywhere ev everything you know just i love that man so much literally that man is my husband but he doesn't know yet next have you ever cheated on a test or on a game yeah i'm a honest people you know i'm a, I'm a very what people man my grandma I'm a very honest person, you know. Yes, I have. I okay. I think that you cannot cheat on outdoor games, you know. I don't think you can, but I think you can only cheat on inner games. Like I've cheated on Ludo many times, many times while playing with my grandma, while playing with my friends. I have cheated many times on Ludo, and okay, I support cheating in Ludo, you know, because I it's fun, definitely. And I play, and for outdoor games, I play badminton and i don't think you can cheat on outdoor games literally i li literally don't don't think you can cheat on games and yeah i do cheat on ludo but don't cheat on relationships guys don't ever cheat on someone it's disgusting next biggest regret of not practicing maths when i had the chance and now i'm dreading like my terminals are very near like maybe it will happen in january or february and and i am a like a little goat 
लाइक आई डोंट नो एनी थिंग अबाउट आई डोंट नो वट टू प्लस टू इज आई टू कैलकुलेट ऑन माई फोन लाइक वट टू प्लस टू इज या इट्स फोर लाइक दैट यू नो टू प्लस टू इज फोर राइट या लिटरली आई एम लाइक ड्रेडिंग फॉर माई मैथ्स नाउ दैट्स माई बिगेस्ट रिग्रेट आई थिंक फेवरेट फूड चिकन चिकन इज माई फेवरेट लाइक लिटरली चिकन एंड चाउमीन लाइक नूडल्स स्पगैटी but chicken will be forever and always my favorite food yeah okay now they are giving me dare i dare you to give me a shout out just joking or let's you want i want to i want to give a shout out follow this person follow them uh i'm a, i'm i'm just cropping the picture and will give the link below in my description follow them guys just follow if you love me if you care about me do follow them they are the best and next the dare is do you do your best impression of farmani granger i wish i literally wish that i can do the impression of her but i can't you know i have a speaking problem you know like i can't speak too fast and not with english accent or in hindi accent my next dare is like do your best impression of farmani granger guys i wish I can do but I can because you know if you don't know that I have a speaking problem in my throat from my from the from the very first time I have a speaking problem in my throat that I can you know do like that and not with other languages yes I can do it in my mother tongue which is bengali I can speak pretty fast in bengali but not with any other any other languages you know not in english not in hindi try to understand what I'm saying you know sir me right and you know what my biggest insecurity is that i can't explain things you know it takes me literally a decade to explain things like now i'm stuttering understand me that's my biggest insecurity literally number 2 like num other dear is from fred weasley's wife now they ask number 1 favorite book other than the hp series fantastic b series fantastic b series and the twilight saga and maze runner first book i've read the maze runner first part and it's it's great it's amazing i love that now question number 2 your favorite band the vamps if you don't know guys The Vamps are my favorite band. I am a Vampty, you know. I love Vamps. The Vamps. You can search them on Google or in internet or YouTube. Listen to their songs. I love them. Like I love I I love the four of them, but my favorite is Bradley Simpson. I love that man. He's so cute. Number 3. Do you mind giving me some advice on how to tell my crush I like him? Of course. I mean, yeah, let's be a love guru. because why not um you know if you if you like someone just tell them tell them go up to them and tell them it might think oh my god what she's saying but it is like do not waste your time if you like someone tell them because life is too short to take your time you know like if you don't tell them tell him now you will always think that oh my god i had the chance i had the time but i didn't because i was too scared like I am not a didn't person. I am not a if person. I if I like someone, I am just go tell them. And if I see that the boss likes me, also sub crush on me, I am just go ask him. Hey, do you mind having lunch with me? My mom made biryani, like that. All right, I did. I did on my class seven, seventh grade. And the boy said yes. Why not? I love. The boy said, yeah, I love biryani. and it just happened it was great the relationship lasted long until he left me for another girl jerk and that's the advice like if you like someone tell them because life is definitely too short to take your time just go up to him tell him hey i have a, I have a crush on you uh i like you and then wait what they say you know wait and listen what they say then come back to me if my advice fails Yeah. And question number four, favorite female musician. Britney Spears, of course. Britney Spears and Sabrina Carpenter, both of them. I love both of them, and maybe Ava Max, but Britney Spears and Sabrina Carpenter are my favorite. 
both of them literally both of them i love them now next is from my favorite the one and only ashley khujur i think your surname spells in khujur if it's if it does not pardon me i beg from the corner from the bottom of my heart uh, she asked question number 1 your birthday my birthday is on 13th july i was born on 13th july 2006 in a hospital in calcutta now question number 2 your favorite song oh my god i don't have one like uh, i think i have one it was it is shape of you by acharan yeah but i th- i i think that i have a good music taste so every song i listen is a total bop you know but i think shape of you is my favorite one and then she said that that's all i could think with my small brain girl i love you marry me girl you are my favorite you know just marry me how much what you need a boat a ship a mansion what do you need just give your hand okay next mm mm hmm uh janavi saxena asked when is the fourth part coming like of the george weasley story it is already there i'm currently working on the part 5 1 i think it will be out in the next day because yeah it will be out soon thank you for reading it thanks next is amelia 2010 There are some truths. What she asked, what's the secret you haven't told anybody? I I haven't told anyone. Like not anyone. My friends doesn't know that I have this YouTube channel, you know. I they doesn't know my friends or my best friends. Only only one except one nobody knows that I have a YouTube channel except my mom. My mom knows. My mom knows what am I? doing with you all yeah she even reads my stories who you guys like i was shit 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 that's a spicy part coming in how she's going to react and then she's like that's the best you can write i was like i have a cool mom i have a pretty, a pretty cool mom and i don't know why my mom calls robert pencil robert pencil like mom how that even doesn't make any sense but let her be enjoy her life mm. and then then she said you honestly don't want to know man i don't want to know if you if you are okay with it if you want to share with me you can always as i said the links are given not i mean not in here in the description and then she asks what are the reasons you like cedric except that he's hot I just told I just answered this one all right I love him all right I love every inch and every bit of him like in his like everything man from his from everything from his kindness to intelligence from his bravery everything you know everything about him is attractive you know what I mean like everything about him is attractive and that's what I like and he's not like a like a braggy character he's not like that You know, he just a suffering silence type, which I like. I love him. There are so many reasons I can think of, but my dumb brain can't think of one. Now, moving on. <clears throat> what's some advice you wanna give us? Some you guys give me advice. I don't know what I'm doing with my life. You guys give me some advice, literally. And some advice I wanna give to you, like. What can I say? Be nice to your parents if they deserve it. Be nice to be nice to everyone, you know, even if the person is treating you like shit. Always treat them nice because you know the drill. Kindness. Kill them with kindness, guys. Yeah. Why am I always spring? Why are we always spring? Next. Have you ever needed a hug but had nobody to give you one? Yes. You see I'm a hugger you know I love hugs as much 
I love to give hugs. I love to receive them, but no one gives me because certainly uh, because apparently my mom hates affection. So it's just me. I just hug a pillow or something. That's just my sad life. Kiki asked, "What's your favorite thing to do on a rainy day? Just stuff in a under a pillow and just sleep. That's my favorite thing to do on a rainy day because you know the weather is chilly and." You know, there's some breezes, cold breezes coming here and there, and it's just a lovely weather. But it's definitely a disgusting weather when you have to go out and work. Like there's mud, there's water, there's dirty water, there are toads, frogs running around like biak. Next, Zina Singh asked, "Why do you like Cedric?" I told you there are so many. There are infinite. reasons that why i love him next tom's lover asked oh at first they said oh my gosh jo apologize in advance oh my god they are going to give me hell my spider sense is telling me that number 1 what was your strangest dream My dreams are so weird guys you know my dreams are so weird that I don't I, I don't even remember my dreams after like 6 to 7 seconds my brain is like what dream you had a dream like i forgot so i don't really remember what my strangest dream is sorry question number 2 what is your favorite nickname please i i can't say that okay it's true i have to my nickname is My favorite nickname, my favorite nickname is Jay. The one that you called me, Tom's lover. Yeah. My favorite nickname is Jay. Thank you for calling me that. I appreciate it. Question number 3. Guys, give me some credit. I just dodged the question. Question number 3. If you made a genie, what would be your three wishes be? Bestie, you better bring that ring back to life. I will. I would. You know, I have, a, I have a better idea in mind. My three wish will be number one: infinite money and food. Number one: infinite money and food. You know, infinite money means I have any amount of money. You know, infinite. My money will never end. So is my food. Number two: mm, like you can eat anything, everything, but not to gain weight. You know, not to be fat. I'm. Okay, first of all, I'm not body shaming, or am I not advising that don't be fat? No, but I just want to be like, I can eat whatever and anything I want without gaining weight. You know, without become unhealthy. You know what I mean? Yes. And number three will be marry Robert Pattinson. Yeah, that that will be my three wishes. Be yeah. Question number four: Do you have? a valuable item not necessarily expensive but meaningful yeah i have i have uh but what i have i know i do have one but i don't know what it is question number 5 what is the biggest fear of ghost of ghost my biggest fear is them you know horror things horrifying things like ghosts i believe in them i believe in ghosts that they do exist and i'm fucking scared sorry it's not it occurs i'm scared of it i'm scared of him question number 6 do you have a secret talent i don't what do you mean by secret i don't have a talent all my talents are like i don't have one a secret talent is my secret talent is Okay, why do people drink coffee? For you know, for to get energy, not to be lazy, not to sleep. You know, my talent is I can drink eight cups of coffee and still sleep. That's my biggest talent. It was a secret talent, but now it's I just open up to you. That's my biggest talent. I can drink coffee, but then I can't sleep. Masterpiece. And my most important question: How are you so? pretty you sure you are uh, pretty me you sure i'm pretty now well i'm not just an average looking indian girl but 
you know what you are pretty i haven't seen you but i know you are pretty next i dare you to move on so, uh, it is from uni love good i dare you to move on but from what from what move on but from what no i'm joking but actually here's some truths your favorite line from any harry potter movie and book is always i mean you know i the last part you know a scar like jk rowling cut that part off but i love the last line of mm, the ending yeah i love that one you know yeah i love that one mhm and your reason for choosing that line i just don't know it just bring back so many memories to me you know that that the last line of the very last book it just bring back so many memories that i have uh, that i had while reading the while watching the movies and reading the books you know yeah it's that's my reason it, it brought me so many memories that's the reason that's a very dumb reason but that is the reason now next okay now next is from mrs hardgreaves hardgreaves is that is it how to pronounce it i'm sorry if it's not the right way to pronounce you are five hardgreaves wife i like it mhm she asked or he asked or they asked your idol mine is michael jackson ariana grande my idol is shahrukh khan my idol is shahrukh khan I love him. I, f- I worship him. I worship that man. Next, your comfort song. Mine is "So Times" by Madison Beer. My comfort song is "Dandelions" by Ruth B. You can f- you can hear the song. It's on YouTube. Just search "Dandelions" and it will. Be the m- I love that song. It's beautiful. Now, dares I dare to give me a shout out? Guys, come here. Come here. Follow her or them. I'm gonna give their link also in the description box. Just follow them, all right? They are they are my biggest supporters, and you are also. So follow them. And number two, dear. Now the second, dear. I dare you to post a pic of Rob from your camera roll. I will. Okay, I will. After posting this video, after some minutes or some hours, I'll post um, a picture of Rob from my camera roll, from very first picture of him. So here it is. It's end. end of the dares and truths thank you so much guys for supporting me and you know for keeping me company and you guys are always here to listen to my bullshit or my bullshit works thank you so much my camera is so shitty man yeah thank you thank you so much for being there it is appreciated you guys don't know how much you appreciate me all right thank you thank you thank you thank you so much love you Bye. Be safe and take care. I love you.